Welcome to Women of Impact, Women of Influence, Women of Value, Women of Wealth. I want us to discuss the issue of raising stepchildren. What is important, it is the agreement while you were courting with your partner. What have you agreed upon? It is very important to consider the former parents involved them to the life of the children. If you decide you need, to, you, you need to plan, are they going to stay with us or are they going to stay with their former parents? If you are agreeing that they are going to stay with you or they are going to stay with their former parents, health maintenance plan, how are you going to maintain them? How many times a week, a month, a year are you going to visit? How many times are they going to visit where you are currently staying? where you are currently having the new family that you, you are building. Don't call the children direct if you decide that the children will stay with their former parents. Don't call them direct if you need anything. Involve their parents. That it shows sign of respect. It shows some respect to the other parent that you respect that parent, that the parent is taking full responsibility of the child. If you decide that you want to stay with them, you need to set rules. The rules of the house are very important to say, if we are staying with them, both of us, we are not going to call the children as, these are your children, these are my children. No, we are going to put them in the same pot. We are going to treat them the same way we are, we are going to treat the child that we're going to bring in this family, or even if we don't bring one, but we, the treatment must remain the same. There must be no partiality in everything. Let's stop this issue of saying, I can afford my kids. Yes, we know you can afford your kids, but now there's a life that must happen. We are building a new family here. We are building a big family here, and this family is called ex-children. We need to involve them in everything that we do. If we decide they go to private school, let them go to private school, all of them. If we can't afford them to go to private school, explain to them, let's take them to government school. There must be no one goes to private school, no one goes to a government school. No, it will, they need to be taught to share everything that they have. As I conclude, I want us parents to be sensitive. Let us be sensitive to the issue of children because they become what we give them. They become what they hear. They become the environment that they are in. Don't use examples of other people. Don't come here and want to say, so and so's family, this is how they do their things. We must find our own ways of doing things that suit us, that will make our family grow. Please, I beg you parents, children are sensitive. They, they need our love, they deserve it. They didn't create a problem for themselves. Let's listen to them. Let's hear their views. Let's grow them together.